and welcome back to Miscellaneous Mabel. If it is your first time here, um, welcome. And yeah, if you'd like this type of content, miscellaneous content, then please click that little subscribe button and give me a like to get my videos out there. So for today's topic, I want to talk to you guys about your passion and um, your driven, your drive for life and for your career. Um, because uh, uh, this is what I'm currently dealing with today. I like to make content about what's on my mind, what's going on. And currently today I am dealing with um, multiple content ideas in my brain. And I'm trying to figure it out and sort it out. And I just realized my passion. I am I am just thriving with my passion right now for this type of lifestyle. Um, the freedom lifestyle. The working for myself one day lifestyle. The financially freedom lifestyle. Um, and I've done multiple um, career choices and the things that I want to be doing right now, the things I want to focus on to work, build towards my, my career, because that in the end is what we are building towards. Um, so I am currently multiple things. I'm not just a dairy farmer. Uh, I do multiple things at the moment. And I'm thinking about one of the good things I'm thinking about joining again is my photography. So I used to be a photographer back in South Africa. Um, uh, somewhere on my Facebook, you'll find um, my photos. I actually had two different businesses, photography businesses. One was my uh, Mabel Stratum photography. It was more wildlife, landscapes, the type of photography I really love to do. And then the other one uh, was ML photography, which was people-based um, weddings, couples, all that shenanigans. And I'm actually thinking about carrying on with the ML uh, photography. So my, it's my, my uh, full name. Um, but I might change the, the name of it, basically. Call, just like call it miscellaneous photography, miscellaneous mobile photography or something like that. I still haven't fully decided. But the thing I want to get to is I've never thought, like I haven't thought about, I won't say never, but I haven't thought about doing my photography business again because I just got so tired of being working with people that are rude and think that you're their service, like you're their mate and everything and just putting so much pressure on getting their photos and I just, I was getting tired of the people, um, plus I couldn't work um, in a different field while I'm here in New Zealand uh, until I got my residency, because when you get your visa, you're only allowed to do work in the field that you applied for, which was dairy farming, so that also stopped me, but um, it wasn't a heartbreaker for me to stop, I just, yeah, stopped because multiple reasons, um, and my passion, my passion and drive for it died um, until recently. So this all started with the affiliated marketing, my, my new career, my side hustle, if you want to call it, um, because I'm a dairy farmer <laughs> and I'm not going anywhere soon. I love my cows. <laughs> I love the work. So I'm not going anywhere soon. So the affiliate marketing career is kind of like a side hustle uh, along with my other ones. But that started everything because I got so into the whole creation of digital and um, marketing and everything and affiliated. Um, it got me researching and I, I absolutely love researching type of things like I love writing down and I've got like my little mess section at the moment um, where I'm just doing my research and it just lit that fire in me that I want to do more I want to create more like I'm on my off days right now I should be resting or cleaning house or whatever you want to call your own rest I should be doing that right now but I'm not I'm here sitting on my computer I am researching topics I am um, looking into different options for my businesses because I've got my two TikToks that I'm creating content for which takes majority of my time right now um my free time right now because you want to get ex you want to get out there you want to start making money from your affiliate marketing plus um my one TikTok miscellaneous Mabel TikTok is kind of connected to my YouTube channel which is trying to get out there I want to get my content out there I want to um help people as you guys know that is my biggest thing is to help other people so they can learn and see from my life what I'm doing and how to do it differently plus I'm trying to get better at my content because I've got this mindset I don't know if you guys have seen I've got a little plaque underneath my screen that says student mindset like I'm always in the mindset of being a student of being learning le have a learning mindset like you've never you never know enough um so that's kind of like I'm jumping all over the places with the different topics but this is currently what's going on in my head and it's all related to passion like my passion has just been so lit on fire again. Like I just want to get out there with my content. I just want to show you guys that do this or do that and you'll get there. You'll get your 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 
career, you get your money, you get your your life that you so desire. And that's why my passion is just like pfft, everywhere right now, as you can probably see in this five minutes, I've rambled about multiple topics and I've talked about many things. But I want to show you guys that passion, that 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 oh that drive. Like I'm sitting here on my off days, like I said, I'm supposed to be resting, I'm supposed to be doing something else other than work. But I don't see this as work, to be honest. I don't see my content creating, my um, digital marketing, my digital creations, my affiliate marketing. I don't see that as work at the moment. Like I am quite enjoying it. Um, I'm quite loving just sitting here and thinking of things and what to create. Um, writing down ideas, uh, figuring out what's my next step, watching tons of YouTube and TikToks, like it consumes my life right now. Um, but that all gives me ideas and helps me to get into my feedback for my content. So I really, en I'm really enjoying this, this time in my life right now. I've had a few bad days last week, but I feel like that's behind me. I'm getting back into what I love and I'm building both my platforms like uh, my YouTube has increased in subscribers, which, hi, thank you for being here. I am so happy you decided to subscribe. I'm super stoked. In the beginning, I knew it was my family members that were all subscribing because I posted out about it. And so when I got, the, got those first few followers, I knew it was all family members, uh, which I do appreciate so much. But now I've gotten a few extra ones, which I did not send out for. Like, I think it's like, it's, it's actually subscribers, which is super, super awesome. So hi to you. Welcome. Um, and then both my TikTok channels have grown to over 400 um, followers on both sides, which I'm really stoked about. Um, be like my affiliate that's grown twice as faster than my miscellaneous one, which is super cool. But it's all got to do with the passion. Like people need to see your passion. People need to see your love for the thing that you're doing, the content you're creating. And I, th I think it might be starting to show, which is awesome because like people... People want to see positivity. People want to see, like, the they want to see the difference. They want to see people living out their lives and see how they can get to that. And um, I am very stoked and very blessed that I can that that I've decided to do this. Like, I'm very blessed by God that um, He's actually letting me do this and showing me how what to do and what to say and leading me into what I should be doing for my life. Because, like I said, I've been wanting to do this for over a decade I've been wanting to do this and I've always felt like this is the route that I'm supposed to step on I have to be in the public eye I have to be stepping out of my comfort zone and um, doing my videos and all of my content like this like this is what I've always felt most comfortable with and um, I've always put it on the back burner because I was like oh I'm not doing it now I'm not doing it now um, I'm too like I'm, I'm too shy I'm thinking like people are gonna judge me and say stuff about me but God has always kept this behind, like behind my ear, behind my, like behind my eyes. Like one day, one day I'm going to push you and you're going to do this and you're going to, you're going to struggle and it's going to be difficult, but you're going to do this because this is the path that I've created for you. And I feel that's manifested and that's, that's securely set into my mind now, like with the end of 2022 and 2023 starting that's been manifested into my mind, like securely said, like, you're going to do this. You're going to fail. You're going to stand back up and you're going to keep on going. That passion in you is going to be on fire. And I've gotten that so securely set in my brain right now that I don't think I will ever stop. <laughs> I don't think I will ever stop. Even if I, even if there's one person that learns from me or one person that enjoys my content, I don't think I will ever stop because once that fire is lit, you will keep on going because you know you're on the right path. I feel like for every person, if you know that you're on the right path with something, nothing's going to stop you. You're going to create content, you're going to try and convince people, and you're going to keep going because that is just, you know that it's the right path for you. And that is where I'm at right now. That is what I am feeling, and that is my feelings and my feelings alone. Um, and it's just all got to do with that fire, that passion that's just been lit in me. Um... And I hope it's, it's it's transferring to you guys where you see what I'm talking about. Um, and I'm not just rambling into the abyss for nothing. Um, but yes, I just, I got this. It's what, uh, 12, 13, 12, 24 right now. And I just had this overwhelming feeling of doing this video and getting it posted. So this will be posted today um, just to get that out there because this is going somewhere. Like this is not just me rambling on about nothing. I feel like somebody needs to hear this. Somebody needs to know that 
get that passion, find something that you love, start focusing on it, and that passion of yours will reignite for it. Like, we all got a plan on this earth, we've all got a story we need to tell on this earth, and if it's for one person or if it's for a billion people, your story matters, and you just got to need to find that again. You just need to find it, all right? I hope you guys enjoyed this ramble um, about passion and everything in between. Because, man, I enjoyed just talking to the camera like this. Like, I can ramble on for hours. I just love this. Because um, I do feel like I'm talking to somebody. Like, I'm talking to you right there. Like, I am talking to somebody. And it's just, it's awesome. It's a wonderful thing. So I hope you guys have a great day, a great week. And I will keep you guys posted. Because tomorrow I'm going to my specialist for my Achilles tendon. Um, and I will be vlogging a bit tomorrow. So I hope you guys enjoyed this content. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!